Hi, I'm Oz Balabanyan from the Research VR Podcast, and today I am reviewing, for the first time, actually, we never really review many things, the Hookverse Binaural Microphones. So for this review, you want to be wearing a pair of headphones starting now. So now you're actually hearing things coming through the hook microphones. They're actually sitting inside of a, an ear-shaped mound so that it's capturing sound the same way that an ear would hear it. Um, this is what that looks like, which is a pretty neat feature. You can actually put the microphones inside of this head-shaped thing. And uh, let's put it back on the camera. To demonstrate how well this works, we're now going to be wearing the microphones, and you're going to come with me to go get coffee. A day in the life of Oz Balabanian. Let's go get coffee. I'm just uh, testing out this new microphone. It's yeah, it's a, it's a mic that's supposed to like sync up with a video that it records the sound exactly how you hear it, and then when you watch it afterwards with headphones, it sounds like you're me. Is that one of those like situations where it like switches left and right channel and it feels like you're it's, like surrounded by sound? Kind yeah, of thing? yeah. It, it sounds. That's some trippy stuff. It's really trippy. It like captures. Is that for me? Oh, perfect. Cheers, man. Take care. Let's see where Courtney is. Mm. Let's see where she is. Ah. Don't kill me, Muni. Where is she? Just kidding. She showed up. She didn't leave me behind. No, nope. almost. Ah, oh, not like usually. <laughs> can you hold this for me? Yes, I can. Thank you. All right. There's a there's a here. there's a hat in there. Hat. That's what they call them. Oh. You. <laughs> up drinking all of the coffee. Oh. <laughs> well, that's the best part of it. Yeah, I forgot my keys. Sorry. <laughs> I think there are I'm people at the house. I'm not through the goddamn window again. I think there are people in the house. Ah, it's open. We're all good. We're all good. That concludes our going and getting coffee in a day of the life of ours. The hook is a pretty interesting product because it's one of the only it's one of the only binaural microphones that actually is fully wireless and it works with your iPhone and Android phone and even with a GoPro uh, where it plugs straight in and records video with the audio already embedded so you ha there's minimal amount of post work that needs to be done. Uh, a product that started off as a Kickstarter now is being sold on Amazon for $239. Another aspect of the Hookverse uh, microphones is that they are also wireless earphones. So they have a 12 hour battery and the, on the inside of the microphone are the earphones and they are sound insulating, they create a nice seal around inside of your ear. Basically it can be used as wireless Bluetooth ear, earphones.
I have a pre-production product review, and so there's some features that weren't working, like uh, the calling feature, which the founder tells me that it wor works both on Android and iOS. So what else do I think about these headphones? Um, I'm a huge fan of binaural. I'm a huge fan of binaural microphones, simply because it's such a simple technology that works so effectively to put someone exactly in the shoes of another person. Um, they work best when you close your eyes and you just kind of let your mind wander into the sounds that you hear. They work best when you're actually moving and walking through a space and, and things are changing. The sounds are, and the environment is changing and, and you're, you'd, you'd be surprised at how well your brain can actually fill in those details. And that's traditionally what binaural has been good for, is, is to do sound recordings, music recordings, uh, acapella recordings of, uh, of in spaces. And uh, the one of the interesting things about the Hook Verse is, is the fact that it integrates video natively. So what that means is the app that you use to run everything for the microphone actually has video recording features and basically takes away all the processing work of having to match a video and an audio clip together and having to export that to then share it. It's all mobile optimized, ready to be recorded and shared instantly. Um, all of that I really, really enjoy. Um, I love the fact that the hook can do it all inside the app and I'm able to put this video together pretty simply. The sound that you get back from these videos are quite nice. Um, everything that you hear when you're standing there is exactly how it's recorded in the microphones. All of that is really cool. Um, however, the uh, I did run into some issues where the audio kind of glitching out at certain places in the video. This is likely due to Bluetooth transfer issues and uh, I got a recommendation from the founder that if I turn on airplane mode then you'll ensure that there's no wireless interference happening. One of the ways I really think this product shines is by using a mobile gimbal and so this if you load if you put your phone into here you have this beautiful smooth stabilized video of what you're seeing along with the audio that you're hearing on the spot. Now, as for the price, I think this is uh, in the mid-tier range of binaural microphones. So the, the cheapest binaural microphones you can buy are around $20 to $25, and even with that, you need a separate recorder that you plug things into and you record separately. Um, the next tier up seems to be the Hook Verse at $239. It's definitely not cheap microphone to buy if you're just out and about, but this is um, for people that are really interested in this technology that want to create, uh, a, let's say, a VR 180 video that is now becoming popular with YouTube. I think a binaural microphone works really, really well, and I'm excited to be using this more. My final thoughts are that I wish the iOS app had a little bit more polish. Uh, certain design things like the level meter was a little counterintuitive to me at first, uh, but once I figured it out, I think things work pretty well. It has different customization options for for ears. I'm notorious for having problems with in-ear headphones for that reason, but I was able to switch out the foam of the earphones and actually get a good fit for myself. So I hope you like this review, and uh, I want to thank Hook for sending me a pair of these microphones. Uh, this is not a paid endorsement or sponsorship deal. I'm just doing this because I'm really interested in the technology, and uh, the company wanted me to review it. So. Here it is. Thank you all for watching and for listening, and I'll see you guys next time. I want to thank everyone that has been supporting me on Patreon this week. Thank you for Hector Modrigan, Hector, Mo Hector Modrigan, Hypno Zero, Ken Harper, Mark Gillis, Nima Caspian, Nicole Aptekar, RBS, and Rob K. Thank you all so much for supporting me on Patreon and to help make this video happen. So. For those of you who don't know, the Patreon is live and there's multiple reward tiers that you can sign up for and get early access to videos just like this. So thank you again and I'll see you guys next week.